All right, I'm gonna show you guys here what uh, a counterfeit optical drive looks like. Blew my mind to think that somebody is actually gonna try to make some money off of counterfeiting something as um, outdated as opticals, but apparently there's profit margin there. So here is a legitimate, I've bought many of these. Uh, it is an ASUS, Let's see if we can get it in there. It's an ASUS um, 24B1ST. Let's see the label. There we go. Brand new. This is an OEM packaging, obviously. And I'll show you what this one looks like. Oh, the packaging. Let's put the shoddy camera work here. Okay. As you can see, it's got the ASUS label on it. Pretty much on every level with the exception of that. If you take the drive out, you will see the ASUS label on it, as well as all of your FCC labels that are required, letting you know the lasers kill, model numbers, manufacturer date, everything on there. Serial number also comes packaged with the ASUS driver DVD suite. And so we can get a good shot of that. And of course, here is the front of the drive. Flipped over. E Green, your X Multi, RW DVD Multi. Of course, you have your light, your, your little uh, release, everything. Now, here is the fake counterfeit ordered on Amazon not directly from Amazon comes in a brown box with you know just generic RW 24B1 SD should be identical then somebody's nice homemade label there same model number okay thanks like you normally would pull it out the first thing you'll notice right off the bat <laughs> bear in mind this is the same supposedly same drive very similar, obviously, cutouts. This is not supposed to be off of it. Uh, I've ordered three of these, all three of which came without it. As you can see here, it is floating around. In fact, when this gets taken off of it, it slid out. This centerpiece was actually out floating around. They come right off. So, it's magnetic. But, looking at it, there are no markings whatsoever on this drive. Whereas on the other one here, we can see them. They did go as far as to put a void if removed type sticker on it. As you can see, it's not even the same type of sticker. Wraps all the way around. Very, again, very, very generic. Where you have two little dimples, whatever those are good for. Nothing over on this one. And, of course, if you look at the fake, this was really fun. They're in a different order, if you look at the front bezel. Um, at the same time, too, the disc compact portion is partially faded. They, they, they did a really terrible job of uh, putting that like white paint on it, basically. But, yeah, I mean, this is an attempt to pass one off, and had it been not falling apart I may have plugged it in not thinking twice about it to be honest with you but that wasn't the case they all fell apart you can see the the glue that they used on the edges here they used a glue to try to glue this on metal to metal pretty funny anyway there you go counterfeit CD-ROM drive